I'll share a very specific story with you about uh, a guy I got to know because I was looking for a shining example of somebody that understood the difference between being one of a million and being one in a million. This is Nick Santisiro. Uh, he's from Cardinale Way, Mazda in Mesa, Arizona. I talked with him extensively. He has over 250 reviews that were written for him, not for the dealership. These are reviews for Nick. 250 is an astounding number. That's more than uh, than a lot of dealerships have. Uh, so just to put it in perspective, but I asked him, you know, I asked Nick, what do you do? What is it that makes this work for you? And some of the things he told me actually break it down into, into two points. It's first that he understands the importance of it. Nick is a highly competitive guy. He is absolutely keyed in on making sure that everybody in the store knows that he's at the top of the list and that drives him. He also asks every customer. He has a process in place, the dealership does, that they follow. So when you put yourself in a position of asking every customer, not just the ones you think are going to write a good positive review for you, the thing that happens is that it, it's a culture change. It forces you to treat every customer as if they're the next one writing a review. And what that does for Nick is it causes him to be at the top of his game all the time. He makes a conscious decision every day when he suits up for work that he's going to provide the best possible consumer experience that he can provide because he looks at every customer as if their feedback is going to be given whether he asks for it or not.